It's at times like this, when my bones rattle with a mixture of adrenaline and the remnants of Scarecrow's fear toxin, where I feel I'm losing my way. This city that I've devoted myself to threatens to crush me with the weight of my unwavering commitment to her. But sometimes it's too much. I become numb to the pain. Each new atrocity is only an echo of a night prior. It all blends together. I can barely remember. <sighs> Master Wayne, are you all right? My injuries are catching up to me, Alfred. And the toxin isn't helping. Push on, Master Wayne. The Scarecrow is fleeing Gotham Gardens and heading for the roads. I just need a minute. I keep telling myself that this is all worth it. But I've begun to realize that I've been lying to myself all these years. I can't change the world in my one-man crusade. I can't even change the city in an appreciable way. Maybe the only thing I can change is myself. He's gone, Alfred. I'll have the Wayne Enterprise satellite scan for his license plate. For now, I suggest you get some sleep, Master Wayne. I don't deserve you, Alfred. I'll always be here. The city gazes at me with disappointment. I'm not sure if anything I'm doing even matters. I tell myself that I'm making a difference. But this city is just as rotten as the day I put on the cowl five years ago. Is this realistic? This obsession of mine? Is this what my parents would have wanted for me? I'm just tired of my city turning into a cesspool filled with corruption and crime, and I'm tired that I'm the only one doing anything about it. But I can't do this forever. Mother, father, I have something to tell you. I just can't explain it. In the past, whenever I had lost hope and the darkness inside of me had become too strong to resist, my parents would lift me out of the shadows and fuel me with the strength needed to carry on. But that won't be enough tonight. I'm sorry, mother. I just can't do it. Not anymore. It's too... Painful. A wave of relief passes over me that I haven't felt in years. The beast grip on my soul loosens just a bit. I feel at peace. But that never lasts for too long in my experience. You fool! You think you know pain, you coward? I'll show you pain! I'm not sure how, not sure why, but as my heart floods with terror, I'm sure of one thing. I'm facing myself. Have I gotten your attention, Bruce? Who are you? Who am I? Don't be stupid, Bruce. You know who I am, and you know why I'm here. I see you've been looking at some pictures. Feeling sentimental, are we? Uh, here's one from Christmas. Mom. Dad. Christmas is always hard for you, isn't it, Bruce? They left when you were so young. You often wonder what it would have been like to grow with them there to guide you, to love you, to be alive there with you. But they're dead, Bruce. They're dead 
just like everyone else has died because of your mistakes. Because you fail to do what is necessary. They died because of you! Stop! Dead! 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 Please! Stop! This isn't real. The toxin should have worn off by now. No one can save you now! charge here. I am. You don't control me. You never have. Control you? I saved you! You really think you would have survived this long without me, Bruce? I was an inevitability. A necessary end. You never wanted to admit the truth. And you never have. That's why you prefer to call me Batman. But I know the real reason why you'll never escape me. I've handled that fear alone. You, you may have found a purpose for that fear, but I supplied you with the means of distributing it to others. We will take all of that pain, all of that rage, and all of that fear that you had bottled up inside of you, and we would share it with those who deserved it. But at what cost? Look how it's affected me! You're, You're too soft! You don't get the bigger picture here, do you? God, we used to be magnificent back then! We descended upon this city like an unholy instrument of vengeance. That only works for so long. Sure, criminals are spooked by the Batman, but then the terror fades, and I grow weaker. Oh, I couldn't agree more, but not for the same reasons. You see, Bruce, we used to be a force of nature, acting above the law and enacting our own will. But then, you wanted to be a hero. You wanted the city's approval. You wanted the police to idolize you. This war necessitates allies. 
My involvement with Jim Gordon and the GCPD furthers our cause. Do you honestly I believe- will not discuss this! Very well. Back to the matter at hand. Escalation. At the same time that our crusade was terrified of low-life criminals, it also seemed to nurture a more extreme type of criminal. Power-mad geniuses, sadistic maniacs, stealthy opportunists, obsessive psychotics, all seemed compelled to answer your unspoken challenge. They've killed thousands, and you won't kill them to protect the innocents? We are not killers. I will not have any more blood on my hands. You speak of blood! I will show you blood! Lucius Fox, Jason Todd, Selena Kyle, Barbara Gordon, dozens more! Bruce Wayne! The Humanitarian. You self-righteous hypocrite. You talk about the sanctity of life. And yet you lie under countless victims. What about their lives? Or are they just the cost of protecting your sacred morality? The Joker, prime example. Ever since that fateful day at Ace Chemicals, when you pushed him into that vat of acid, since then, he's in and out of Arkham Asylum. And every time we catch him, and allow him to live. Only for you to put him back so that he can break out again. To kill and murder. All this tragedy and murder for the sake of your own precious code. Have you anything to say for yourself? I can't, I can't, I can't do it anymore. Tell me how to carry on. choice here, Bruce. You will not dismiss me, and yet you won't yield to my will. You want a normal life. You wish to be rid of me. Then you must kill me. gun. I recognize it. We both know what gun that is, Bruce. Use it. One shot from that gun will do it. Think of it like a fresh start. Free from responsibility. Free from fear. Free me. Free yourself. suicide. This, it wasn't my life. I know, but it is now. This is our destiny. We lost our chance at a normal life a long time ago. We can't change the past. All we can do is protect others and give them the chance at happiness that we will never have. You have to accept that. I can accept my truth, but you have to understand one thing. There is a line that we cannot cross. No killing. That's the only thing that separates us from them. As much as the Batman is a symbol of terror and vengeance, he too must be a symbol of hope.
you can live with that, then Bruce Wayne can accept the ultimate responsibility. Agreed. Contact Commissioner Gordon. Tell him I'm on my way. Yeah. 